felt like we knew you or you were real with, with anyone. And then your son's mom said that you just put in for child custody once you got off the show. You never really helped raise him and you weren't really a father to him. Excuse and you me? just kind of used him. How you know how I am with my son? I don't. I'm telling You're you. You're right. Then why are you saying this stuff? Your, uh, your son's mom actually came and approached me. Um, and I was, I was pretty blown away by some of the things she said. So now, I don't know who to believe because I don't believe you on a lot of ways, so, and I just met her. I don't believe you right now because I know what she would say. She happened to say that the way you had Brody, you cheated on your girlfriend with your, uh, uh, your Excuse son's mom. Excuse me? These are words you don't know. Well, I don't believe you, so, well, I don't believe you, so, I don't believe you, so, I don't believe you. <gasps> no, <please. laughs> okay, Katie, wait a minute, can we just, who's, who's ex? doesn't say crappy things about them later. Amen, wow. brother, like, amen. Who doesn't? Yeah. And who's what, doesn't? And what a card to play, though. Yeah. You're a bad dad. You're a bad dad. You're a bad yeah. dad. Yeah. All right, so give us an overview. Katie, weigh in first before we slide over to Trevor on sort of your overview of last night before we get specific. Um, it was awesome, as usual, <laughs> full of drama and uh, intrigue and mystery, and um, I uh, loved it. But I do think that... <laughs> Love. Where is she reading this? She's reading yeah. it somewhere. I'll get to I don't know. She's so enthusiastic yeah. about I it too. And it. I loved it. No, but I, I do think that this season in particular had a whole bunch of mean little boys. Oh, self-righteous. Like, yes. Last night to watch the show, there were so so much self-righteous uh, guys wanting to take the moral high ground. Yeah. There's, some, there's, not, there's not a lot of moral high ground there. They were all trying to get yeah. onto it. And a lot of uh, a real man does this, a real <laughs> man does that, and way too much She's so wholesome, she's so pure. It made me feel icky like white lace lingerie does. <laughs> and when are you um, spotted in that? Wearing white lace lingerie? Oh, I don't wear it. Oh, I <laughs> just like no, no, but you oh. know, like you know how everyone wears white lace like oh, yeah, white says, lace lingerie yeah. and it's supposed to be like innocent and pure, but it's somehow even sleazier than black lace lingerie. Oh my gosh, yes, yeah, so you know true. What I mean. uh, let's talk about uh, Mickey and Casey. Uh, they have this is this this was sort of indicative of these like I don't want to say tete a tete, but that would like allude that they had a brain or a mind. Mm -hmm. But like, the, like, take a look yeah. at this. <laughs> James, out of your mouth, I heard you say, if I can make the top four, I can become the next Bachelor. I'm getting sick of this. We can meet all these tall girls with a lot of money. None of those oh, type of like, none oh, of those type oh, of attributes. Oh, no, that I, tall girl. All right, let me I tell you right now. I didn't I've been so, wait, hold on. I've been sitting here the I whole time James. listening okay, to this. Okay? okay, Mikey, go ahead. I've been sitting here the whole time listening to this. Why can't you look at me, number one? Because why I, couldn't you I let James finish? Will you let me finish no, and then I you'll won't. have your time? No, because you guys chose to, to talk about me. I'm, I'm a player on Us Weekly and all you'll of a get sudden. Your time. Because you <laughs> but I made the cover of Us Weekly. Did you see I, it? <laughs> yeah. Mom, mom, uh, let's talk about that. First of all, uh, everyone called out there in three different ways. I thought when he stood up, the whole back was going to rip out of his suit. That was <laughs> See, I, I, I love this this episode all because they show all the women in the audience and the faces that they make. Uh -huh. <laughs> and all I can think of while I'm watching these women make these ridiculous faces is I think, oh, a sad group of spinsters dressed up like hookers. Yeah. That, and I thought <laughs> Hoping that one of them will catch one of those guys that didn't oh make my it to gosh. the end. <laughs> well, and at the beginning, when they went to all the viewing parties, I was alarmed that there weren't more cats in attendance at those viewing We're parties. We're not talking about the <laughs> We're talking about the dudes. The okay, dudes. the dudes sorry, are sorry, a bunch of dudes. rhino men. Yes. You know what I mean? No, like there I don't are know what you mean. Like yeah. roids, like big no the neck safari, men. They're all big. The other, yeah. running. And they run at each other and they ram heads. Yeah. And it's, it was like, it's it's like a bunch of testosterones in gray suits. That's what I saw last night. Is it really? Is oh. it really? Because I have a clip that's gonna, you know what? Bring it down. I have a clip <laughs> of total sincerity. I totally disagree with you because I found this person to be completely Compelling. authentically. <laughs> Take a look at this nugget. Oh, wow. It hurts the most to say goodbye. When all you know is just one side. And watch you leave with other guys. He's amazing. No, what do you think? What do you think Des is thinking? Let's talk about that first. Because that, that to me, I mean, first of all, a lot of people speculating that you think actually, Katie, he's yeah. going to be the next Bachelor. Oh, I think they're totally set him up to be yeah. the next Bachelor. Yeah. You do? So okay. Des was sitting there trying to swallow the chunks that came up in her throat. 
because <laughs> that was the cheesiest thing ever, right? But look, they gave him like special lighting and like all the great sound stuff. Like they're setting him up for, for some sort of success. Yeah. He's gonna get a like country music contract yeah. out of this and he's gonna be the next Bachelor. Although I just wanna say, lay off the mystic tan. Like oh, he's 31, yeah. he looks 51. <laughs> yes. Lay off, dude. I've been there myself, George, I know it gets addictive. George Hamilton is George, one spray away. Exactly, <laughs> one spray exactly. away. Exactly. <laughs> yes. 31 years old, come on. Come on, buddies, get a little sunscreen. Uh, but I think too, just coming from a theatrical background, Trevor, you can probably speak to this, this was highly manipulative. Just, I mean, not that the whole season hasn't been thus far, <laughs> yes. but like as she sits there and, and sort of trying to keep what's in her tummy down, I also think she can't believe that, that the producers would do this to her? A little bit, yeah. yeah. But wait yeah. a minute, wait a minute, okay. wait a minute. Or that he Let's would just say, what's her, what's her one trait that we have so far about her? What's her one emotional trait? She cries. cries. She cries every episode. <laughs> We're gonna see so much crying in the next two weeks <laughs> from this broad. She's gonna like look like a cornhouse doll by the time it's over. Like Alice so, Cooper. So I think them coming out and bringing, letting him sing is just another way to like turn on the waterworks for old Dez. She, she kept it together though, man. She, did. she kept well, it together. Well, you, you could tell when she came out. She'd been coached backstage. It was like yeah. it was like the Jerry Springer show where they like work you into a frenzy so that you right. come out and you nail people to the walls. Yeah. And she came out and she wanted to nail people to the walls and she was like, you were. In a relationship and the guy said you were in a relationship with 25 guys <laughs> and that shut her down <laughs> uh very quickly we have to go to break predictions um well i agree with what trevor was saying right before we went on is that um she's gonna send drew and chris home and um she's gonna pick brooks and he they're either gonna run off into the sunset or he's gonna dump her Okay, and so that's you guys stand united on that sort of. Yeah, that's what's gonna happen. And, and I hope someone will do her hair. I'll do your. I will do your <laughs> hair for you. Oh, and you said at on some Twitter point, that I will you do, do it for, it for free. free. I, I will do think, her hair I for free. Go, but, but Trevor will do your hair, and you know what? He's great that. with hair. <laughs> Hair and fashion, actually. You guys will get both of them. We gotta go, but uh, always, always lovely to see you two. It's nice awesome. to see you. Nice to see you. Hey, Trevor and Katie, we love these guys. Uh, it's The Bachelor, you know, it's The Bachelorette, and who will be the next Bachelor? We'll find out. But we'll also find out what happens next week, and when we come back, more fabulous fashion after this.